everybody, welcome back to another episode of Huey's Tackle. Uh, tonight I'm going to be doing a painting and this is also going to be the giveaway video for the 100 subscriber mark we finally hit. I just want to say thanks to everyone that subscribed and liked the channel. So tonight we're going to do this, uh, I guess this uh, blue back herring uh, real scale pattern. Before I put the white base coat down. I just went ahead and put it in the netting here without a base coat. I'm gonna spray the base coat through this. And we're just gonna spray it straight onto the base. Get the belly fairly good. All right. Next, I've got some uh, pearl white load in. I haven't heat set yet. Just gonna go over the base fairly lightly with this pearl. Now we're gonna heat set it real fast. All right. Next, I've got some of this. Comar opaque urethane. What we're gonna do with this is we're gonna spray it down the sides here at an angle across the back. Alright, next I've got some of this Createx transparent leaf green in. We're just going to do the same thing we just did. It's going to spread right along that blue there. Alright, now we're going to heat set again. Alright, next I've got some of the Wicked Detail Yellow loaded in. <clears throat> Me personally, I like taking my end cap off whenever I'm trying to do a fairly straight line. What we're going to do is we're going to run a line right below the green there. Just like that. Clean that tip off some. Then we're gonna do the same thing here. Now we're gonna clean the gun out. We're gonna come heat set this and take it out of the netting. Then we're gonna to touch this back up with some blue. All right, next I've got some of the original blue we had loaded in. We're gonna come back and touch the back up here. Now we're gonna heat set. All right, next color we got loaded in is a wicked detail yellow Ocho. What we're gonna do with this, we're gonna hit this blue here and kind of darken it up.
both sides. Kind of a little heat setting. Next, we just got a little bit of transparent uh, light brown. We're gonna go pretty much straight down the back with it. Hit this real quick. Now we're going to throw in some detail sepia. bit of this uh what is this createch fluorescent sunburst we're gonna add a little bit to the throat around this hook and a little patch right there Pretty much done besides the clear coating it and put some eyes in. Pretty much once you clear coat it, all these little scale marks, you'll be able to hold it up and see through the bait. And that'll turn out fairly good. Once it's clear coated, it'll look something like this 130. It'll make the colors blend a lot better. Because right now you really can't tell they're gonna look similar. But once it's cleared, it'll kind of blend everything and make it look a little better. Also, I've been using these. I've been like using these little things here. It's like water slip paper. I've been using this to put the, my name on the bottom of the baits instead of handwriting them. And also for the giveaway, we'll do... Uh, I'll do five custom baits of anybody's choice. All you have to do to enter is uh, subscribe to my channel, like this video, and uh, comment on this video, and I'll give you a number like we did before. So I just want to say thanks to everybody that's subscribed and watched. Stay tuned for more, and I'll have some more coming for y'all soon.